What's up guys, Barry Gaming here, back with some more Idle Heroes, and today we're on the Dot Meme team. We got some stuff to take care of here, uh, almost to another free Soul Awakening here. We're of course done with our EOS, but we're not quite sure what we're doing just yet. Like, ultimately I want to keep those Stellar Shards where they are because we're getting very, very close to 5 million Crystals of Transcendence. Uh, we have everything but Forest and Dark done. Forest is going to be a tricky one. Like, the only dot dealer that could possibly do this would be a Flora. And I really don't want to build a Flora. We built that on the Twine Mean team, and good lord, was that miserable. I think what we're going to do for now is we're going to prioritize building up our Drake. So, let's take a look at this event so far. Uh, looks like we got some gems for us right there. We got a bunch of four-star tavern quest started. We still need to pull out more five-star heroes. Not really sure exactly what type of rewards we can expect on this account, though. I'm not expecting too many. 9,000 more crystals of transcendence is cool. Uh, we might as well send not one. All of these so far get us some heroic scrolls, which we're not going to be doing any of this week from the looks of it. We just need to keep saving up resources, but big old butts. I think we do need to go to the Drake here. So can we make a 10 star food? Uh, it looks like we have some starlights. I think the answer is yes. Where is starlight? You're right there. Pretty sure we can get this going, get our Drake up to E5. 9, 10, 11... 12, 13, 14, 15. Oh, yeah, only need 13. Never mind. I don't know why I'm counting 15. <laughs> I don't know why I was doing that. There's the last 10 star. And now that does mean we should have a Drake copy as well, chilling in the bag, which is perfect. We can come on over here and we can max him out to E5. Now, Sea Land. <laughs> That's going to be the tricky one. We need to gear him up, ready to go for Sea Land. I think. I think he needs unbending bull, but maybe not. Uh, we do need to upgrade this stone. And I think before our issue was gold, and it looks like it still is gold. Attack attack precision is not horrible. Everything but speed is there, which is fine. Yeah, let's let's do this. Let's come on over. No, wait, where am I going? Here, there we go. Let's come on over here. Let's get the imprints out of the EOS for now since she is done. And let's take the Drake. Oh my goodness, I forgot about leveling him up too. That's not a lot of gold. Um, um, uh, <laughs> that's not gonna be anywhere near enough. Uh oh. Uh, so yeah, this is gonna be a little bit of a project for us. Three twenty-eight. Oh my goodness. My goodness, this is going to be rough. Uh, but at least we do get void imprints on him. So that is the one bonus here. We get a lot of stats. But we don't even have his base stats built up just yet. And then we have to see what type of five-star heroes we have to support the Drake. Hopefully a bunch of Amon Ra's. But I really don't remember what I had on this account to help support him. So this is a big old question mark. We'll find out right here. We obviously don't have heroes to put in for a home i don't believe but we can check so there we go there let's come on over to our cloud island check this out uh drake who does drake have in here nope uh, i don't think any of them i don't think any of them i don't think any of them uh oh <laughs> we don't have anything well <sighs> interesting well wait did we have walt was waldick one of them i can't remember Nope. There we go. Uh, no, it was Natasha. Come on. The assassins, that's so brutal. Um, I guess we'll go over to the Drake icon now since he's our current goal. And a 10 star, or I mean 9 star puppet is perfect, which is good as well. Okay. Dark faction. We have a couple Amon Ra's and that's it. Mm -mm. No carries, huh? 
Oh my goodness, we can't even level them all up because I'm out of resources. Oh no. Oh my goodness. Oh jeez. Oh man. Well, <laughs> I think gold is an issue for us. What do you think, guys? Um all right. Gold is the major setback on this account. Um yeah, I guess we wait because we're definitely not spending on this account. That's for sure. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we do get some gold from this, though. We do also have broken spaces that we can smash. Let's try to get that done. Let's smash this with our team, although this team is going to honestly kind of suck. So I don't know how good this is going to be. We'll just get whatever resources we can right now. You know what? Even if this is bad, I don't even care to watch because we have an absolute miserable... Oh my god. A miserable team right here. It's just not good at all. We are doing these in like two hits, which is not bad. Um, I'm hoping we get to seven. I'd hope a V4 Drake would be able to do that with all these badges we have. Another smash there. Get these rewards too. I just we just need rewards. We need them and we need them bad. Um, do we dare hit the 378? Oh god. Oh god. It's taking a long time. No. Well, we did get a lot of resources off of it. Either way, like guess I'm happy ish. Uh, let's first try to prioritize him. There we go. Up to 345. Let's also get back over here to our Amon Ra's, finish leveling them up. I guess I wasted a lot of gems at this point. Go figure, me doing something stupid. All right, so both of those Amon Ra's are good. We're going to need to snag another Amon Ra at some point or carry. There's another Amon Ra right there. I kind of like that. You know what? I'm buying it. Am I buying two? I'm buying two. I'm buying two. We're getting two of them. There we go. We got two more Amon Ra's coming on this account. We do have more energy, I believe, as well. Yeah, we got one more energy right there. Let's take a look at energy artifacts. Um... Definitely want this crown. Well, do we want the crown or do we want the Punisher? I feel like either one of them might be good. So we're just going to grab both of them off and then we can play around with that. Uh, do we really not have any other energy artifacts? Hmm. Well, I guess we could put a crown on one of them. <laughs> I guess that is going to be our... Wait. Oh, I was like, wait, yeah, shouldn't we have one more Amon Ra? I'm getting confused on myself here. Oh, Barry, Barry, Barry. All right, so we got four Amon Ra's. We don't have a carry just yet, but I think this is going to be enough to push him a little bit. Punisher Staff, Attack Attack Precision. Um, I guess we can upgrade this further now because we do have the gold from Broken Spaces, which was pretty huge. Uh, we can take it all the way up. Attack attack skill damage is not bad. We'll just hold on to that one for the time being. Get on over to dark. Let's see how far we can take this. Something like that. Something like that. All right. We got a ton of Amon Ra's. Hopefully they can survive. We got a lot of shields too. Oh yeah, I kind of forgot we're way down in difficulty. Let's get our way up to like, I feel like 15-ish is probably where we'll start feeling a little bit of pushback. This is also going to get us a lot more food, a lot of four stars, and a lot of light and dark shards, which is good. Uh-oh. Uh 12 were already experienced difficulty. That's not good for us. Um, Let's see. We buy two dark, and then we can actually buy a ton of these. 500 shards. Holy cow. Um, Okay. No, we whiffed on both of them. Anything good here? Wow, three Jara, two Vesa, holy cow. Uh, yeah, no, not really. So, this Drake seems like he might struggle a little bit for us. Maybe we do have to go to the crown instead. Although, I feel like a lot of it just comes down to his dodging. If he dodges, he wins. If he doesn't dodge, he loses. I 
having these Amon Ra staying alive is very juicy for us. I guess maybe it came down to his dodging abilities and he wasn't dodging at all. Because that went very easy when we actually watched the fight, yet we lost like a bunch of times. Alright, we got a lot of Amon Ra shields up. We got another layer of Amon Ra shields coming again. But that active from the drag is what gets you. And that's why you kind of need the carry. I like this. Wait, why were why 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 were we not healing right there? Don't we have balance strike on? Or is it because I killed him? Is that why what happened? Interesting. I mean, this does seem to be working pretty good. It just comes down to the RNG on him of if he can just continue to dodge all the incoming attacks. Getting that boss down immediately is kind of good. Um, I think know his active ability does not go for the lowest HP target. And now the boss recovered. Yeah, maybe we just go with Unbending Will instead. Maybe that's just the better option. It, does, it seems like most of the time when he is critting anyway, he's like... He's killing the target when he's critting. And then therefore we don't get a heal from Balance Strike anyway. The yeah, Amon Ra CCs are pretty solid too. Kind of offsetting their energy a bit potentially. Although that was weird that he didn't use the energy. Don't know why. Uh, this was looking promising. The dodging is very good. It's like a 70% dodge chance which is amazing. And that's how you get victories in Dark Sea Land with a Drake. He will definitely take us there. I do feel like having like a 10 star Amon Ra might be what we need, but we're going to try to do it with just baby Amon Ra's and we'll throw in like a baby carry as soon as we get one. Yeah, the fact that his active doesn't attack the lowest HP target feels really bad, but killing off those backliners are the most important thing. I don't know if we're going to have the damage here, even if we continue to dodge. We need to get that defense down on the boss immediately. We got two rounds. Don't die. Oh, it's so close. <sighs> What's his crit chance right now? His crit chance is only 20%. Okay, all right. Let's try to find the crit crit attack stone. Let's just see if we can find it. If we can, that would be amazing. If we can't, we'll just have to deal with what we have right now. It's bad compared to like Transcends Heroes where it's like you can inject the crit onto the, your at hero at any time. Um, Armor Break doesn't really matter as much. Holy probably is a better stone. But again, at the end of the day, I want crit, crit attack. And we're just literally going to melt all of our gold here. The one bonus is we do have a lot of conversions here to try to get this. We've seen every single attack stone except for attack attack and we've yet to come across crit crit attack. This feels really, really bad. Is speed crit even worth it? Probably not. I think we need crit crit attack. Wow. All of that didn't get a single crit crit attack. That doesn't make sense though. He's only got a 20% crit crit chance, which is very low. With the stone, it would bring us closer to like 40 to 50%, which would be nice. And they just wiped out our whole back row. Again, we need to try to target those priests first because those are the annoying ones. We could also try dropping Purify and go more for damage because we're already having the high roll anyway. So the chances of being stunned is actually quite low on our hero. Like for them to actually stun him. Ooh, this is really good. Oh, that's really good. All the priests are down. Sadly, both of ours went down too, but that means there's going to be no healing to try to fight against us here. It's going to need some crits. We're, we need some crits to get that extra bonus damage. All right, 1v1. 1v1. Come on, you got this. Big crit. No crit. Need a crit. We need a crit. Please active. We even have the Phoenix burn. Okay, that's good. That's good. That's what, 15 done? Oh man, I don't know if we can push much further today. I think we might just call it and then we'll use our energy 
attempts tomorrow. But yeah, I don't think Purify for CC is really necessary. This one's actually going really good. Holy cow. Our heroes are staying alive, uh, the support heroes, for a very long time. Yeah, it's just our crit chance really sucks. So every gold I get is literally going to go towards his stone. Wow. Okay, never mind. Maybe we can keep pushing a few more of these today. And then in a day or two, maybe get him up to sea land 20. Maybe we'll do an awakening on him as well, if possible. Yeah, I think we'll call it right there for now. Uh, okay. Pretty solid day on the dot. Wait, no, not the dot. Um... Yeah, the dot meme team. There we go. So we'll just take Drake. We'll get him finished. We'll get that all C lane 20 done. And then what we'll do is we will replace our Drake with something else. I don't know. I mean, he's kind of got a dot in the way his black hole mark works. I know I'm cheating, but it is what it is. Hopefully you guys enjoy this one. I'll see you guys next time.